is quite exciting. Shush. I had a little bee. I had a little beetle. <laughs> beetle was his name. <laughs> and beetle was his name, and I called him Alexander, and he answered just the same. And I put him in a matchbox, and I kept him all the day. But Nanny let my beetle out. <laughs> yes, Nanny let my beetle out. She went and let my beetle out, and beetle went away. Man away. It's much easier with a mask on. Because <laughs> you can, you don't care what people think. <laughs> Beetle dark ran away. On YouTube. She said she ne didn't mean it, and I never said she did. She said she wanted matches, and she just took off the lid. She said I mustn't worry, and I really mustn't mind, that there's lots and lots of beetles that she's sure that we can find. She said I mustn't worry, but it's difficult to catch an excited sort of beetle you've mistaken for a match. I'll take it off now. So, I looked in all the places that a beetle it's might be near. Band. People wouldn't have expected that to be me, <laughs> would they? And I made the sort of noises that a beetle likes to hear. And I heard a sort of something. And I gave a sort of shout. It was a beetle house and Alexander Beetle coming out. It was Alexander Beetle. <laughs> I'm as certain as could be. really long. <laughs> and it had a, he had a sort of look as if he thought it might be me. He had a sort of look as if he thought he ought to say, I'm really very sorry that I tried to run away. I think I'll put this back on. And Nanny's very sorry too, because you know what she did, and she's writing Alexander very blackly on the lid. So Nan and I are friends because <coughs> it's difficult to catch an excited sort of beetle. You've mistaken for a match. <laughs> <laughs>